It's Chibi here, we're at CBIT 2014. I'm with Five Tiles who have a new keyboard. Now, um, yeah, we're often seeing new keyboards, but this one is kind of uh, designed for the smallest uh, screen space usage as possible. So, Mikhail here is going to give me a quick demo of uh, Five Tiles on, on a smartwatch. So, what you're seeing is five um, on screen buttons, each of which has a set of the alphanumerics uh, in them. Um, one of those alphanumerics is underlined, and that's the primary uh, numeric or, or alphanumeric on that button. And then, to get a second uh, um, alphanumeric, you actually slide across. So I don't think you can see that on the V. Let's see if we can get a little bit closer there. So we're actually doing this on what like, looks like a one-inch one inch touchscreen here, and um, it's pretty impressive. Um, so Five Tiles are telling us that uh, it takes about a half an hour to get to, to know this. And uh, I had a go, yeah, I, I, I obviously need half an hour to get to know this, but perhaps you could, uh, Michal, give us a quick demo yes. on, on, on the tablet here, and maybe you could even talk about what's going on here. Hi, hello, I'm Michal Kubatsky, I'm inventor of uh, Five Times. So, uh, this is the keyboard designed specifically for touchscreen devices. As you can see, it is very compact. It takes uh, just a fraction of the, the screen. But the keys are much bigger than on the traditional QWERTY-based keyboards. And the, the layout is based on the alphabet, so you have you roughly will know where to find the letters. The most frequently used uh, characters, you get them underlined and you get them with a single tap. So if you want to type uh, E, it's going to be a single tap. It's going to be a single tap on the blue one. And there, from there, you can slide to get the other characters. So now, if you close to the so if I want to type A, I'm starting from blue, going to green. B is blue to yellow. C is blue to orange. Uh, because we use these uh, uh, combinations of the, the, the strokes, we have almost unlimited number of characters that we can, that, that, that we can uh, code with this keyboard. So I can use the Polish or Italian or German characters without changing the settings. I can use the special symbols directly from the keyboard without looking to, uh, and going through the another screens. So, um, any other devices you think this might uh, be useful for? So we are now working on the on the smartwatch version because we believe that uh, 2014 is all about smartwatches and uh, uh, this is a great solution for uh, for the text input on the smartwatches. Uh, one more, another device that we are looking at is the Google Glass, because at the moment there's no text input there, and our solution fits perfectly the, the touchpad that the Google Glass has on the side. So we are already working with a with a with a group of developers to to have the five tiles working, and that's going to be the next uh, the next device that we're going to launch. Well, that's great, Michal. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you. This is Five Tiles. We're at uh, CBIT at the uh, Great Britain booth, and. Um, yeah, Google Glass owners, keep an eye out for the Five Tiles app in your app store pretty soon.